The Fairy Tale Chapter 391. Uh, Grey has reached the, his unstoppable rage after hearing that Silver's real identity is Deliora. And everything that Silver has been doing all this time is to mislead us. He is indeed just as cruel as all the other demons. But we see more of his Ice Devil Slayer power also. Because since it's an Ice Devil Slayer uh, magic or curse or whatever, Grey's eyes does not work on him. Yeah, he can just eat it. And we switch back a little scene to the UVS scene, where she asks a question a lot of us has asked as soon as we saw this. Why would a wizard or whatever that can the Thet demon be join a guild of demons? Well, technically the Liora is a demon, but still. That question was not really answered. Uh, the Keith only says maybe it was just a whim of the King of Hades or something to keep the other demon slayer. Or maybe uh, the King of Hades just did that in order to keep the other demons at, at bay. But then again, given the fact that the King of Hades sees himself as all-powerful, it's very unlikely that he needed someone who could slay a demon with with demon slayer magic or curses or whatever because well he could just have taken care of them himself but also maybe because he is so arrogant he think this is beneath me you fight something like that either way uh, gray tries to fight with everything he got but he can't so he becomes a little bit creative it's also a little bit funny but at the same time oh come on he shoots debris using ice cannon, but then Deliora Silver freezes the entire field. Greja smiles, because we remember the time when he cha flew the... channeled the ice devil slayer power in the Sun Village. He decides to do it too, because he knows that uh, even though Deliora can absorb... Uh, Ice, he cannot absorb his own power. He unleashes a ba beam of ice. However, Deliora is still unharmed. Just smiling that even though he cannot absorb his own ice, it doesn't work on him. All the and he also smiles, saying that he will kill all of Grey's friends and Leon after this. He learned Ice Devil Slayer magic just so that he could become immune to ice. Grey is fading towards despair. This is not good. For Grey, at least. That's basically this chapter. And now Deliora has... Or oh, Silver... Let's call him Silver Deliora. Have finally dropped his mask. All in this arc, he looked like a token good teammate. But now he unleashes his true might and true... Uh, uh, well, not resentment. Uh, true fearful, where he looks down on all the others, because he says to Grey he's gonna kill all his friends after he killed Leon. I actually thought Leon would uh, arrive, but maybe it's next. Next week's chapter is supposed to be called You Must Not Forget. Which makes me wonder, maybe he will have a flashback on Uru's time. This was a fight that uh, did not really... It looked like it would get turned around, but then it a twist happened and Deliora is still unharmed. I did not like the despair, but I still liked that the twist uh, was that uh, even though Grey tried to do a one-hit KO once again, the one-hit KO failed. So that's a good twist. Because a lot of people complain about Fairy Tales, one-hit KO doesn't make sense. So here you can say, Grey tried to do one and it did, and it failed, you know? Still, good chapter, yes, too much despair. What will happen next? How will Grey defeat Silver Deliora? I think the only choice is to use the water. I mean, if Ur is part of the ocean, uh, but then again, no ocean is near where they are, he could just absorb the water using his ice make and attack Deliora like that. <sighs> Who knows? I'll see you all in next time, and give me your comments, please.